Do you want to find out if you have a negative mindset? Do you want to think more positively? Or are you wondering why is positive thinking even important in the first place? Well, I'm going to answer all of those questions with today's featured book in this video. Let's do this. Hi there and welcome to the Bookster's Club where we find daily inspiration from the books you love. Today's featured book is Avoiding the Cosmic 2x4 by Rita Louise, PhD. And today's inspirational thought comes to us on page number 76, it says, Our perceptions of events in our lives endeavor to keep us congruent with our beliefs. Our perceptions are selective and differentiating and typically focus on one thing excluding all others. They tend to reinforce our beliefs. Because they reflect the truth we choose to see, so if you believe that life treats you unfairly, then you will pay more attention to all of the bad things that may happen to you during the day rather than acknowledging any of the good. Then at the end of the day, you can say to yourself, just like I thought, life sucks. So when you have a belief or if you have a lot of thoughts that are constantly consistent, well, what's going to wind up happening is you're going to look for things in the outside world to reinforce those beliefs. So if your belief is that life sucks, then you know what's going to show up for you or you know what your mind is going to focus on and pick up on? That life sucks. And that's not what we want. We don't want more of life sucks. We want good things to happen to us. Why are positive thoughts so important? Well, negative thoughts can cause depression and can cause stress. Also, you can start to create a lot of things out of those negative minds that are going to start to show up in your life and that your brain is going to really start to focus on and say, see, I was right. There's a really great article called What Mentally Strong People Don't Do by Amy Morn that I wanted to share with you. The article's great. I'll leave it in the link in the description below, of course, but I wanted to share the acronym that she had. She has an acronym for blue. So here's all four of those letters. So the first letter is B, blame myself. So people that think negatively constantly are beating themselves up and blaming themselves and telling themselves I'm not good enough or I always screw up or I can never do anything right. And the problem with that is if that is something that you constantly believe, it's going to start to show up in your life and tell you that you're right. So it isn't just about blaming yourself. You want to be crystal clear that everybody makes mistakes and adopting that belief is a lot easier on yourself than telling yourself you're always a screw up. If you can simply see that everybody makes mistakes, you won't take those so seriously when you do, you know, have an accident or you make a mistake or you don't do something perfect. Well then, you know what? It's not that big of a deal. L, looking for bad news. Looking for bad news can be a really big problem because there's good news and bad news out there. And the problem with looking for bad news is you get this super hyper focus on all things that are bad. And of course, those things are not only going to show up, but it's going to have an actual negative effect on your body. It's going to put stress and worry in your mind. Um, watching the news every day right now we're all under quarantine and so you know everybody's watching the news trying to keep themselves up to date but then you know it can get like addictive and then you just start watching bad article and bad news segment and it just has this negative effect on your physical well-being your emotional well-being and then that kind of puts a stamp on the rest of your day. So starting your day off that way is not a good idea, but also just looking for bad news in general, that is exactly what happens. It kind of puts a stamp on your entire life. So you, you stands for unhappy guessing. Weird, right? But it actually makes a lot of sense. Unhappy guessing is just worrying about the future. So things that haven't even happened yet, you're just thinking worst case scenario all the time, which of course puts stress on yourself. And also you kind of don't want to create that accidentally in the future because that's all you're focusing on. E stands for exaggerated negativity. This is a really interesting one. Exaggerated negativity is when you get done with an interview and you say something like the whole interview was a disaster or you're in a relationship and you say, you never show me any affection where you're just, again, focused on only the bad things. But you know what? That becomes your perception and your reality. So then you actually start thinking 
you know, your spouse never shows you affection. That's not true. Or that the whole interview was a disaster. That's not true. You spelled your name right, right? <laughs> so, you know, good things do happen. And when you start to focus on only the bad things, your perception now is that all things are bad. And that's the life that you're living now because that's your perception that all things are bad. That's no way to live. I hope that you found this video helpful and I hope that you have made your mind up to think more positively. If you had a different take on this part of the book, a different part in this book, or a different book entirely that you think should be featured here on the Booksters Club, I would love to know in the comments. Thank you so much for clicking the like button if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell if you're new because I post new videos every single day. See you tomorrow, Booksters. Thinking positively is healthier. Okay, so, well, negative thoughts can cause dis depression. Depression. Why are negative thoughts so important? Negative thoughts aren't important. Okay. The first one is B. So the first one, the first one is B for blue. And that's not something that you want. You want to do things right. You want to do things awesome um, <laughs> yes you do you want to do things awesome yeah because i said that because it's not that big of a deal um that that's all that they think about is the badness okay so okay that was good